نحمد و نسلی علی رسول الکریم اما بعد اعوذ باللہ من الشیطان الرجیم بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم السلام علیکم ڈیئر اسٹوڈنٹس ٹوڈے از اے ویری نائس ڈے ان پریویس کلاس وی ہیو ڈسکس دا ناؤن ناؤن از دی نیم آف اے پرسن پلیس اور تھنگ ان وی ہیو آلسو ڈسکس دا ٹائپس آف ناؤن But today we want to start the pronoun, the second part of the sentence. What is pronoun? What role they play in day-to-day life in English writing and speaking? So we start the pronoun. It is a word word which shows which is used instead of a noun. So now you clear that what is pronoun, pronoun are those words which are used instead of a noun. Pronoun has many types. Among these types, subjective case, objective case, possessive case, demonstrative pronoun, reflexive pronoun, interrogative pronoun, indefinite pronoun, etc. as the well known. pronoun in English. But today we have, we only focus on subjective case, what is the subjective case and how the subjective case are used. Subjective case is a dead case of pronoun which are used in place of subject. So, Today we only discuss the subjective case. Subjective case divided into three major parts. and then again they divided into singular and plural and subjective case and first person singular i come but in first person plural we come and second person singular you come and in second person plural you come and third person singular he she at come and and third person plural they come so first person singular i me First person plural we come hum second person singular you come second person plural you 
Тюка. Тон. Ап. Third person singular. He Go She Go Third person Plural They come. Oh. Now you are clear that in subjective case, first person singular I come, first person plural we come, and second person singular to come, and second person plural you come, and third person singular he, she come, and in third person plural they come. Now you are clear. These are words, I, we, you, he, they. They use on the place of subject. Therefore, it is called subjective case. Subjective case are those cases of the pronoun which are used on the place of subject. Now we want to write uh, one table. I go. मैं जाता हूं we go हम जाते हैं you go तू जाता है you go तुम जाते हो he goes वो जाता है she goes वो जाती है They go. Oh, jate hain. So, now you have knowledge that we have used I, we, you, he, she, they, and the place of subject. So, these all are called subjective cases. And in subjective case pronoun, we use on the place of subject. Now, you are clear that what is pronoun? Pronoun is the word which is used instead of a noun. Noun is the name of a person, place or thing. Pronoun has many types. Subjective case, objective, possessive, demonstrative, indefinite pronoun, reflexive pronoun, interrogative pronoun, etc. But today uh, we have only focus on subjective case. In subjective case, we have studied that there are six sectors. In first sector, first person singular. In second, first person plural. In third, uh, second person singular and second person plural, third person singular and third person plural. Already we have discussed these things, and also I write a table on go. So now you are clear what as pronoun, where they are used, and what role they play in the development of a country in speaking and writing.
because if your english is good through this way you will write a very good article you will conduct very good research and internationally you will spread this research to other country and the other country will read very easily and because of this other you will transfer the knowledge to other country and there some return will come therefore it is necessary for every one to cover the role of grammar already i have taken a start from the uh, uh, grammar and then word and then um, second uh, alphabet third word and fourth sentence but now we have told you that sentence has eight part or nine parts now one by one we discuss this part of the sentence already we have cover the noun and today we have cover uh, the some part of pronoun but later on we will also deliver other lecture for pronoun